The Glock 23 for conceal and carry. The Glock 23 makes an excellent conceal and carry firearm. The Glock 23 is a uh, compact firearm. It is chambered and 40 caliber. Very proven round. This is an unloaded gun, unloaded magazine, unloaded chamber. A lot of law enforcement agencies use this uh, model for their sidearm, Glock 23. Uh, it's very reliable, very easy to maintain, clean, all that. I want to do a little video on uh, the ways that I conceal and carry this firearm, the different holsters that I have. I'll put links in the description for the uh, exact products. I have a uh, Crossbreed Super Tut Deluxe hol uh, in the waistband holster that I use a lot of times. Works very well. I'd say it's one of the better in the waistband holsters, the Crossbreed Super Tut Deluxe. show you. Crossbreed Super Tuck Deluxe. You can get it in either cow hide or horse hide, the uh, leather part. It's got metal clips, kydex. It's excellent in the waistband holster. Crossbreed Super Tuck Deluxe. Another little holster I got, a lot of times I'll use this as an appendix holster. It is the Galco Tuck and Go. It just fits right inside your pants. This little clip here clips onto your belt. Your belt, this, this will go down in your pants and this little clip, uh, your belt holds it in. The Galco Tuck and Go. This, uh, the crossbreed holster runs around $70, $70, $80, somewhere around there. It's kind of a premium in the waistband holster. This runs, I think this runs around $30. The uh, Galco Tuck and Go runs around $30, I think. Like I said, I'll put links in the description to you could actually check out the products. Um, another what I use probably more often than uh, any holster is this little uh, MIC holster. This is called the MIC holster. MIC stands for Minimum Inside Carry. These run around $22 or so on Amazon. The MIC holster. And all they do, put it on, slide it on like that. It completely protects the trigger area to where the trigger cannot be pulled. To take it off, you just do the jerk and pops right off. I'll show you how to how I use this. The string, you just take the string, wrap it around your belt, make a little loop, put this through there. Then you snap it on and you just kind of like Mexican carry it. Lots of Mexican carry is just where you stick a gun down your, in your belt. This, of course, is a whole lot more safer because there's no way to access the trigger. Hides the gun very nicely. And another thing. You don't have to worry about the gun falling out or anything. The Mick holster. That didn't work right. Can't see what I'm doing here. Mick holster. 
Like I said, they run around $22 on Amazon. Another way to conceal and carry, like during the winter time, uh, this is a premium holster. This runs, I think, about $170. This is the Galco Miami Classic. Like I said, it's a premium. This is a premium holster. It's a shoulder holster. So, like during the winter time, figure out which way it goes. Your gun goes on this side. Then you've got uh, your magazines go on the other side, kind of counters the weight. Very comfortable if you're going out just out running some errands or anything. I don't know if I got this twisted or not. I don't have a mirror, but uh, yeah, you got your magazines on this side. It holds two magazines, and then your firearm on this side. It's the Galco Miami Classic. Like I said, I'll put links down by the description. But the Glock 23 makes an excellent conceal and carry firearm. It's not exactly a mouse gun like this. This is the North American Arms Black Widow. But it makes an excellent conceal and carry firearm. Very reliable. Like I said, very easy to maintain. Chambered in 40 caliber, very proven round. Block 23. Thanks for watching.